Hey guys, it's Feral here with another mount guide. Today, I'll be doing a breakdown of an older rare spawn known as the Edge of Reality, which yields the Void Talon of the Dark Star mount that you can see here. This mount came out in patch 6.2 in Warlords of Draenor, but since then has been changed. We're pretty sure it was changed in 7.3, but we're not exactly sure when, but things have definitely changed. So I'm going to teach you how we know how to get it now. Thanks to the hard work of others in the Secret Finding Discord, including Tink, Saved You, Tiny Talon, and many others, and myself, we pretty much understand the behavior of these portals. Before I go any further, I want to mention a bug that is known by the Game Masters that prevents level 110s from seeing most portals. We aren't sure exactly which portals and which zones, but it seems to impact ones in Talador, Frostfire Ridge, and Gorgon. The GMs still don't know what causes it, and neither do we. You can circumvent this bug by searching on a level 110 or below, uh, a friend to prove that the portal's in front of you like you can see here, or a trial character. First things first, when does this thing spawn? Well, we've discovered that the Edge of Reality portal no longer spawns during the week. For about a month, we have never found a single portal prior to late Thursday, early Friday morning on the US realms. This seems to be in line with the Pound Fist and Poseidus spawn timers, or rather what they used to be, since they were changed in 7.3.2, and uh, that means that the portals kind of start to spawn around 72 hours, give or take. As for where the portals spawn, they spawn where they always have, except there's two new spawns that haven't been released. I'm going to have those down below in the document. These portals will stay up for exactly 15 minutes before despawning or being clicked on. If a portal despawns, it'll respawn in the same zone roughly two to four hours later. We're not exactly sure about the respawn times, but the soonest we've seen has been two hours. As for the respawn timer on a claim portal, we're pretty sure it starts at 10 hours and it can go up to 48 hours. Now you may be wondering why I'm referring to zones only when I talk about respawn timers. That's because each zone has its own personal 72 hour spawn timer. So that means that a portal that spawns in Frostfire Ridge on your realm like Tychondrius or something has no effect on a spawn in Shadow Moon Valley on Tychondrius. Even though it's rare, it is possible to have two portals up at the same time on the same realm because of this. I have seen this happen myself. As for when the portal is clicked on, the exact same thing happens. You get a scenario, you enter the scenario, there's a dead void talent on the ground and there's an egg. You loot the egg, and you get your mount. And I want to clarify, you can get this mount while you're in a group and you'll get the scenario, but it does not share it with anybody else, so it's different than time lost in ANX. To summarize, the best time to look for Edge of Reality portals is from Thursday night to early Tuesday morning. It's best to fly around each zone in Draenor on your realm and keep track of time since you last checked a certain zone. It's good to find a friend that also has flying to cover three zones while you cover the other three. This is much more effective than camping, but you can still camp if you want to. With all of this in mind, you're ready to start your search for your own Edge of Reality. Have a good day and good luck to you this weekend!